Dr. Tom. So we're going to do a little bit of x-ray talk, as you can see, a few extra, a couple x-rays behind me, uh, just to give you a little information about this patient when she came in. Uh, lots of low back problems, low back pain, the sciatica, radiating pain down the legs, all that good stuff. And really for her, not just about the pain, but you know, she's not being able to do the things she likes to be able to do, skiing, uh, exercise, uh, you know, playing tennis, those types of things here. So came in, we did our initial evaluation. Obviously, we start off with our x-rays. And as you can see here, we did a straight on shot of her lower spine. Now, the main point that I make here is I want to see balance within the spine. And everything's nice and level and balanced. If we look at her sacrum, this triangular shaped bone here, her pelvis, these bones here, I just follow the lines, you can see no balance at all. So it's a good angulation in her in her lower spine, her sacrum, which is causing uh, approximately a 15 millimeter imbalance, right side of the pelvis to the left side of the pelvis. So all that is completely out of balance. And because of that, you can see here, it's got this angulation going on at one, two different spots here. Uh, so we put a plan together, uh, which basically included chiropractic care, functional rehabilitation, which is our posture and our mobility exercises, and neuromuscular re-education, which basically just means we're trying to re, uh, get better communication between your brain and your body and your muscles. So we followed up after uh, her initial phase of care, did some x-rays uh, to see what's going on here. Uh, and now you can see complete, completely balanced through her lower spine. Sacral is completely balanced. Hips, pelvis, completely balanced. She's not perfect yet because you can still see some angulation right through here. But balance through here, balance through here. So she's well on her way to getting near perfect function through her lower spine. But upside for her right now is she's completely pain-free. Uh, she's completely functional because uh, now she's training for a duathlon, which is basically a bike and run competition, uh, which is coming up in May. But, you know, all in all, this patient is well on her way to completely getting this corrected this lower spine problem corrected, not just for today, but you know, a year from now, five years from now, teach her to do the right things at home. And she's gonna keep this in great shape and living the life she wants to live. So great job by her, thank you.